to me that the locals may not be all that welcoming. I like how he cut his dialogue. Are you a tourist? You dress like one. Shit. Slamming it, are we? Must be nice to have a closet. Over here. Over here. Do you want to get thrashed? Come in. Come in. God, you're new here, aren't you? From the parade. Yes. Well, I... How could you tell? <laughs> yeah. I'll tell you how to survive your next five minutes, and in return, you'll give me your socks. Well, that's outrageous. Your funeral. Okay. Why are they so angry? Because that suit you're wearing reminds them of all the jolly, proper, decent wellies who drove them out of the homes in the village. And now we're all cold and tired and starving to death. You better get a nice sharp rock and rip that to shreds. My uncle gave this to me for Christmas. Or they'll rip you to shreds. Shit. I hadn't thought there would be so many. Yeah, it's like the latest groovy nightclub, isn't it? People get a bad batch of joy and it like flips a switch and they can't take joy anymore. So they get chased out of the village. Been a lot of bad batches lately. So what happens if I rip up my suit? They invite me over for tea and biscuits. Then they really won't give a damn what you do, so long as you don't take things that don't belong to you. Or go up and punch someone in the nose. Now you can survive the next five minutes. Cheerio! Craft a torn suit. Okay. Uh, rock. I have a lot of quests. Ooh, I found my drink things. Can I don't think my suit is decent anymore. I could wear it around the garden district, but proper folk will have me pegged for a wastrel. I suppose he's just another rotten downer like us. Welcome to the bloody garden district. What a waste of time. At least we're alive. Right. At least you could drink on the pumps here. Okay. Who the fuck are you? Well, nothing lasts forever, does it? Stay away from the ones of the plague. It's a terrible way to die. What's this? I lied for you today at 4.15. That's not good, Percy. You're rubbish at lying. I was a good liar today. Shh. Who did you lie to? Mrs. Boyle. Mrs. Boyle came here? Her face was all red, and and her voice was like Mum when she's angry. And I thought that you would ask me why she's angry. Why was she angry? I decided that she was angry. But I decided that she was angry because you were up in a tree next to Sally Boyle's bedroom window last night at 8.15pm. Oh, bloody hell. What exactly did he say? I told her that I was in the tree. Oh, Percy, that's very bad. No, Arthur, it's brilliant. Why is it brilliant? She won't make me be in trouble, because I'm slow. You didn't have to do that. She told me not to do it again, so I promised I wouldn't. Thank you. I love you. Arthur. I love you too. Fucking lied to that lady. God damn it. I like how she's just letting me do things. Ooh, first aid kit. Wow. A basket with infinite rocks. Okay. I just realized that was. Ooh. You picked up a book, in quotes. Back in 1964, people read books to learn how to do things better. You should read all the books you can find in Wellington Wells. I want to know how to do things better. Frightfully sharp. And the way they stare at you. Okay. It could be worse. I think. At least you can drink from the pumps here. No, that guy's exactly the same. At least you can drink from the pumps here. People somehow never notice Arthur when he's sitting down unless they're already enraged at him. This doesn't work at night though. 
So if I sit down, I get unnoticed. Oh, this is that wall. Awesome. There's a wall. Oh, what the fuck? I need to eat something. Eating carrot. I can cancel my eating. That's how advanced this game is, guys. What the fuck? Have you been sleeping all right? Well, uh, there's more of us every day. It works. I feel loads better. Percy was never wrong about a thing like that. Point of departure. Whoa! Berries! They grow all over the Garden District, don't they? I guess I can eat these till I run across a pub. <laughs> Extract car. Extract car. A crib. Oh, God. Oh, Jesus. When was the last time there was a baby in Wellington, Wales? I don't know, Arthur. Or whatever your name is. Who am I playing as? Stop! Stop playing, goddammit. Examine what? What's on those beds? Oh, God. I'm not the only one remembering the children, am I? Makes sense. They're all off their joy out here. Teacups. A toy tea set. Funny. Percy never played with toys. He didn't like anything that wasn't really the thing it was supposed to be. Oh wait, so I'm Arthur and my brother's Percy. Okay, I get it. Locked. Aha, but I remember how to make a lock pick. I like how I said that as I'm, I'm going into it. Dig spot discovered, hello. I like digging and killing. Actually, I don't know how I feel about killing. I've killed one guy. Underground kind of place. I think that's the Save place Save a bit for the at. next minute. Shut up, Arthur. I'm trying to talk to my people. Hi. This too shall pass, I suppose. Sometimes, you just have to eat rotten things. That's life, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, it is. Yep. Uh, I got a disposable safe cracker. Oh yeah, da, da, da. it's turning. I gonna kill every day. Stop crying. You're depressed. It makes it worse. I don't know if you should. I don't know if you should keep that in, Matthew. Da da da, this isn't Mario. Why is it this like Mario? <laughs> I can make a Jimmy bar, but I could also make mm, Bobby Pin in my uh, object hole. What? Hell yeah. <laughs> Advanced game physics, guys. Advanced. I wonder if changelings were just what people used to call people like Percy. I don't know what he's talking about, actually. Is there like another way into the... Into the thing? The island I'm on feels small and I don't like it here. And the dig site's on the other side of the bridge. Look at this dig site. What the fuck? Hello. This is 
not what I thought. Requires night. Requires night. Requires night. Re requires re require night. Re require night. Require night. I'm not sleeping because require night. Require night. Require night. 3.16 p.m. 3.17 p.m. Okay. I might just, like, sleep just to see if, if it... If it fucking... You must be chipper to pass. <laughs> 10 out of 10. filing cabinet is very intense in intricate sorry what remove solid garments enjoy a tepid shower put on tidy clothes spritz on some scent peppermint or roses pop a joy watch uncle jack on the telly play a game realize that the, all these filing cabinets are probably empty and the chest is probably a better idea to, to, to look what chest has eyes. Ooh, I could buy things. I might just buy this to have it and never use it again. Okay, uh, I'm gonna go and sleep in the suicidal house. <laughs> ah! Like Spike. Okay, it's 4 p.m. So, like, five hours. Sweet dreams, Arthur. 